I'm Ben with the BTC Sessions, and this is your bullish bit brought to you by bitrefill.com, your go-to place to pick up gift cards, phone refills, and pay your bills with Bitcoin, both on-chain and via the Lightning Network. Check them out now at bitrefill.com and earn sats back as you shop. Bitrefill.com. Energy producers are seeing the relationship between Bitcoin and energy, particularly waste energy. So you see Japan's largest power company um, beginning to mine Bitcoin with excess energy. You're seeing, uh, you know, Russian um, uh, Russian oil producing subsidiaries, uh, natural gas giants, so on and so forth. Um, you're seeing ConocoPhillips diving in. You're seeing ExxonMobil. And the one thing I wanted to point to here is... This is from uh, enerdynamics.com. Um, basically, they're talking about how much energy is produced globally versus how much is actually used versus wasted. And it said, according to the Energy Information Administration, uh, 34% is the actual used energy. Uh, in other words, 66% of the primary energy used and created uh, for electricity is wasted by the time the electricity arrives at the cons uh, customer meter. So massive amounts of the energy that we create is just simply wasted and it could be used for something and it could be used to secure a global monetary network and make all of the energy that is put into pushing buttons and pulling levers and figuring out our economy and doing all of these things to try and hodgepodge together a global monetary system that can just be more or less automated as a base layer of money with Bitcoin on waste energy. Um, and I think that's a fantastic thing. And I think the world will gradually come to understand it. I'm excited for Bitcoin to be an educator when it comes to energy and help the globe better understand what energy is, where it comes from, how it can best be used. So that's why I'm bullish. So.